Hello guys, it is Friday and it's a sunny day and I have a little letter to open to you guys and there's gonna be something for this camera here. So I'm gonna first open the thing and then I'm gonna install it on the camera. Uh, I have to use my phone for filming that, so you guys will see what it is. But I'm gonna hurry up because I'm a little bit of a rush. I need to go down to the bank quickly and um, handle some money before they close and there's only like half an hour <gasps> rush. Okay, so let's open this thing and see what it is. Well, I know what it is, because I ordered it. Uh, I bought it on the web page. Um, they had, like guess, an, an offer on, so I bought it for basically half price. It's cool. Comes a little thing here. It says extra money we will include free. And it says, when proof by Macromath. And um, what we got here, let's put this away. Got this little skinny micromuff here, little package. And this little piece here got Velcro on top. And oh, we'll get a little micromuff buff, uh, a button. We get a sticker. And then we get two of these Velcro things, which is supposed to go on top of this camera to protect the microphone. So I'm just going to be changing over to the iPhone, and you guys will see me installing this little dead cat thingy make my camera into a mohawk <laughs> alright the sound is probably very different now but here is my camera uh, I'm just gonna tie dry off from the very top where the thing is sitting. you can see that the microphone sits up there I actually have the accident to put my finger up there having this little thing sitting on top of there will stop me from doing that because I will see okay the microphone is up there so what we need to do is now is take our um, little skinny thing here uh, velcro peel off the little velcro from the sticky thing if I can do that it's very tiny eh, it is super tiny and I just cut my nail so there we go all right and this have to be fitted on top of the camera around the mix here but without touching the um, the axle, um, see I can see now it's a little bit too long so I want to cut a little bit off this thing here because it's going to cover the microphone and I don't want to do that so I'm going to make a very very thin cut here so that is much thinner and then I can fit it around top wise here and not touch the microphone there we go press it on there Yes, I can still get to the power button, because the power button is right next to it. Alright, it looks like that up there. And then all i got to do is take this little fluffy thing, put it on top, and just squeeze it down to the Velcro, and there we go. I should have a little bit more wind protection, so now my camera is a Mohican. <laughs> so yeah, and that will also remind me not to hold exact there, so I can hold it each side now when I grab the camera. That's much easier like that. So that's what we got, which is awesome. I'm... I'm looking forward to try this out and see if it works as good as people say. We'll test it out because I'm going out now. Um, I'm going to be seeing less of it. Now the only problem is will it fit in my case with this thing on? Probably not. Let's try it on. Let's see here. Not with that on. If I pull it off, it will go in there. And then maybe, just maybe, it'll fit up here. It will. That's good. So, um, yeah, all right. Let's get cracking on, get going out and see Lasse and play some Kendama and enjoy yourself. All right, guys, I arrived down to a nice little park right opposite of where Lasse lives. Lasse is here! Yeah, it's right over there. So now you can go and stalk him. Put a lot of money in his uh, post box and stuff like that. But this is without the wind filter on. I'm going to make a new clip where I put it on so you guys can see if you can hear a difference. All right, and now the new little wind filter thing is on. I don't know if it makes a difference. I hope it does. It should do. The people I've seen use it before has had a difference. All right, big mystery, guys. We've seen something out there, but we don't know what it is. Unless it says this is a bird, because it's shaking his head. <laughs> it has no body. <laughs> so weird. A beer bottle. A beer bottle. It could be a bottle. But not a beer. It's white. Oh, we got... Mikkel here as well. Lass's brother. I love my new mohawk. It works. 
Alrighty, just in the laundry. I've been chatting with the neighbors above. And yeah, the terrace looks fine. We just need to get it clean a bit because Sally's been chewing sticks on there and some dust blows in here. Uh, we'd like to get like some nice um some nice furniture for out here, like garden furniture and stuff. We'll probably eventually get that. Yeah, it is. Hi Sally. Hi Sally. So how does it sound with this thing on guys? Can you hear it? Does it make noise? Oh, does it make less noise? Okay, I'll try and blow on you. Like... I'm gonna try to take it off. Difference? What was that? So it's evening and we just had some nice food. Paul had made some nice pasta and chicken. And as of now, uh, we're going to take Sally out for a walk. When I come back, I'll have a shower. And I will go and see Lasse again, his brother. Uh, we'll go out, um, or first we'll go to Lasse and then we'll go out and have a few beers after. Which is going to be nice and chill. Um, I can't go out too late tonight. Um, it's going to be late, it's about 1.30, 2 o'clock, then I'll head home because i got to go out and help a friend move tomorrow. So I'm kind of busy with that tomorrow. Um, but now when i got this new Micromuff on, um, I will take this camera out and see if we can, even though it's a little bit windy out, maybe it won't do so much now we got this thing on. Hopefully it is working a lot and hopefully you can't hear much different even though I'm inside and filming with it on. Um, it looks kind of funny. It looks like it has a little Mohican now. Um, you guys probably can't see but I can show you by doing this. Taking my phone and switching on the camera and go in selfie mode. And then you can see how the camera looks. <laughs> so yeah, you have a little, um, you have a little little thing on top of now, it looks like a Mohican. It's kind of funny. <laughs> so yeah, that's how you look. Alrighty. And here I am. Hi guys. <laughs> Alright, let's, um, let's go out with Sally and take her for a little walk. So it's a nice evening walking Sally. The sun is going down. We're at the nice little estate area here. I hope you guys can hear me. Um, all these houses are really pretty over here. The only downside is they have like this outside there is like a, a road underneath there. Can you see very there? There's like a hill that is put there on purpose by the uh, people who owns the land area around here, and it's put there so it'll be nice and quiet. Unfortunately, with that, people never get to see a proper sunset here. They'll see the sun go down behind it, but they'll never get like the sunset where you know it's going out over the countryside. But Sally's out here. It's quite windy here, so this is a good test for the new micro muff. From um, uh, I can't remember the the name is it? Um, they call Micromuff. Um, what's the name of the company? Strange, I forgot it. What are you doing up there? Are oh, you a little mountain dog? Wow, this is good wind for testing. It's really windy here, guys. So we'll see how good a job it does. I'm a little bit surprised if it's going to be totally good because where the Velcro is, there's like little loose, like airy connection. You can see through when you look up in the sky. Um, but it should definitely do something. I've seen a lot of people use it and they all said it has improved um, the sound of quality when you're outside in the open air with wind and such. So we hope it works. But it looks funny seeing the camera with a little bit of tuft of fur on top. It's tough or not? <laughs> it looks like um, it got a mohawk. <laughs> oh, they haven't bothered cutting all the grass. Lazy. Alrighty, well, we're going to continue to walk with the little devil there. And then we'll go back. We're only out for her tonight because normally we go out and enjoying it like we did yesterday. But uh, sometimes in the evening it's just taking her out just because she needs to go out. Um, I had a play with her under grass outside the apartment um, but she needs to have a little little walk around and she's doing that now <laughs> right you guys see what I mean now because they got that hillside there which is made to block the noise from the road this is why the people who got the houses here will never see a full sunset they'll only see it go down behind that hill um, different like if you're out on the beach and something you can actually see it go down <laughs> The beautiful houses around here, something like that, Paul and I would love to get a house like that. Um, but these are houses that you pay, you own, um, so they're not probably very expensive. Like Danish, Danish, I would say about one and a half, two and a half million, uh, if you're gonna have something out here. Um, but no, this is an area I would love to live in because you got all this open free space. Eventually, when they start building this road here, it won't be that open, but. 
I think over there where the area is, they're not, they're not going to build there, that's going to be a park area. And you're a little mountain dog again. You love climbing, don't you? You love climbing. <laughs> Sweetheart. All right, catch you back home eventually. And if not, then I'll probably see you tomorrow because I'm going out later. Not very long though, because I gotta help a friend tomorrow morning. So it's only gonna be three or four hours the max. All right, so we just came home guys. And I hope that all the footage where um, the wind has been on the camera uh, has worked because that little fluff thing on top of the camera. We'll see uh, when I edit this later on. But right now I'm going to have a shower and I will um, then be taking the bicycle up to Lesser and we'll have a few beers at Lesser and then we'll go out and maybe get a couple of beers in town. Um, it's it's our local town, Slale, so and it's not going to be that fantastic. But it's just nice to hang out with some good people like Lesser and his brother. They're like really nice. So, yeah. Um, but I think that's going to be for today, guys, because I will be coming home about 1, 2 o'clock at uh, the latest. And then I got to help a friend tomorrow with some moving stuff. So, um, yeah. I'm going to be busy with that. So I'll see you guys tomorrow. Stay awesome. And as always, look after yourself. And uh, I love you guys. Peace. I was so bad. I'm so much better with the other finger. Two climbing minxes. See, now it's... Run, yeah, careful. <laughs> Don't get your leg trapped somewhere. This is where I want to get a picture of Sally.